Hello everyone, my name is Flair Bliss here and welcome to the demo of Virgo vs the Zodiac. And basically this story is going to be about one of the Zodiacs, Virgo, taking out all of the other Zodiac signs. But from the surface of this game, it looks beautiful. But will the story match the artistic features of this game? Well, there's only one way to find out. So this is not a horror game which I usually am used to, but I chose to make this an exception as it looks beautiful. Then you have stress free mode or zodiac mode. Um, I think, as I don't know this game, I'm gonna go stress free mode. Maybe I'll play it through with zodiac mode just to see like the difficulty change, but we're gonna go with stress free mode. So that difficulty to view more information about it. Um, this mode is ideal for people who want to experience the most of the story without having to worry too much about the battles after an exhausting day. The story won't change if you select stress-free mode. You get plus, three, plus 50 to all stats, minus 25 damage taken. You may change this setting at any time with the options brownie key icon. Um, let's just use Zodak mode. Zodak mode is for true Virgo versus the Zodiac experience. The entire game is balanced with this mode in mind. It is recommended for anyone who is willing to take on the whole Zodak by themselves. All foes are challenging and require strategic thinking to be defeated. You will have no changes in the story if you select Zodak mode. You may just change your setting at any time with the options brownie key, brownie key icon. Now I am going to go for stress free mode because I don't know about this game so therefore I don't have to worry too much about you know farming and trying to defeat a particular opponent if that gets to the case so go on stress free mode stress free mode okay key controls directional key is to movement z enter spacebar interact with objects confirm actions x escape number log zero open menu window one two three drink respective healing items that's going to be really important uh page down quickly scroll through text um, that's not going to be ideal as i love to seek out story F4 toggle window full screen. I'm not going to put it on full screen because sometimes it mucks up my recording so that only part of the screen appears on the capture software. Anyway, F3 is the unstretched mode in full screen. F5 is to reset the game, which is something I do not want. I don't want to go back there. Um, I, I presume that saving is going to be something which we're going to encounter as we go through the game we usually either save in certain locations or we can save the menu the constellations aren't aligned anymore the end of the golden age marks the beginning of an era where the zodaks can reign over their realms without the interference of the strict system settled by the rulers but for my sister that meant complete chaos she had vowed to do something about it this isn't unlike of her. If she spots something incorrect, her standards of already in symmetry, she'll destroy it. How could someone live in a world this filthy? Back in the golden age and this, golden age and that, blah blah blah, she'd say out loud while bragging about her purity above others. This is indeed laughable to someone like me who can barely care for what she's decided to risk her own freedom for. I was hoping her just to see how far she would go, for she always amuses me. And this is how she got in trouble 9.14 astronomical units away from here. And if you know astronomical units, that's pretty long, that's a pretty far away distance. Even one astronomical unit is pretty far away in a far, far away realm filled with ghosts. Okay, that part I did not expect. We've arrived at last. Hear me out, you heretics. Your reign of cooperative tyranny shall end today. Mercy will save you no longer. Are we Virgo? None shall stop the righteous perk that awaits your lady Capricorn. Each and every sin committed in the name of your so sovereignage will be judged by my own sacred hand. For I am Virgo, daughter of Mercury and servant of purity. 
and I'll fulfill my duty as the great purifier of the celestial system. The return of the golden age is at hand. Gingerbread man, no one listened to you, Virgo. Oh, look at this. What? Oh my god, that art so pretty. When I was looking at some of the pictures of this game, I was in awe by it. But seeing it firsthand on the game is just even more impressive. What? Hmm? Such nerfless creatures. After practicing this great monologue for so long, we've waited for three long weeks before getting an audience with Capricorn. Capricorn is a, ver is a very busy lady, so this is understandable. Didn't they even notice their grand gate falling down like this? They're Capricornians. They must be too busy with their agenda to notice us. For this is what I shall do. Strike when they are unaware of my presence. But before doing that, be sure to check your daily horoscope on the red pillars. Fate is upon us. Fate is upon us. Temple Entrance I love it so far, I'm not gonna lie. So, we've got our first experience with this and had. The fat small man has no regrets. You have swallowed up too much ice and water to become like that. Okay, wow, look at that menu. Bag, abilities, equipment, status, settings, save dinosaur. Okay. Uh, and also, as a Let's Player, having a 16x9 resolution is an absolute beauty. So it means I don't have to worry about having a filler picture in on the bottom left side of the screen. Okay. Uh, coffee plus one. I only leave this constitution once I have Capricorn's crown at my hands. Um, I'm just coming back here just to see if there are any items, and I got that coffee, which is very nice. Right, so... How do we equip said items? Settings? Unless, of course, they're just predefinedly are... So, okay, Virgo. Equipment. Uh, um, equipment. I don't think. No, I don't have any. I think. Uh, winged boots stolen from Mercury prevents confusion. I like that. Uh, lovely ribbon looks very good on you. Raises. What's that? Oh, raises velocity. And a sturdy Deflyan, customized to allow. Debuffering counterattacks. Uh, I'm still not sure, but a formidable craftsmanship it even shines in the dark. Grants smite. So smite must mean ability. That's what I can say. And optimize means that you can equip the best items that you have in your inventory. Abilities. Okay. Actions. So we've got increased all stats and regenerates. Easy mode. Okay. Do a thrust, a full thrust that deals mutable damage hits twice, so that deals... It's like a double kick from Pokemon, if you know that. Counters a Heretic's touch with a Cardinal hit. May causes a debuff, and defends attacks and regenerates, but receives additional damage the next turn. Hmm. A bit questionable about that. And Purity is just basically secondary health. Back. Um... Yeah, I'm sure. Right. We're just going to go forward and see what we're going to encounter. Right. But beforehand, uh, I'm just going to say once again and go forward. Okay, these fat smoke. Yeah, this is perfectly round. A work of a genius in the snow crafting. Snow crafting, as in, it just falls down upon us. Salary goat, it's one of them. All the highborns must be exterminated. We won't fear hierarchy any longer. Virgo, it's been five minutes since we've arrived, and you've already put yourself in a combat situation. The goatman attacks me first, I'm merely defending myself. Well, considering the last time you fought for real was. I know, I know. And I don't need any help, Ginger. Jeff, just jokey axe. Okay, documents scattered about. Okay, that. 
Are you so sure? I can read you the manual. Jeremiah wrote. Yeah, let him teach you. Fine, let's get this over with. Well, the first thing you should know is that if you run out of hearts, you'll die. Oh, really? But then you have your purity to cast purge abilities. It recovers passively per turn, but you can do something cool to recover a lot right away. Use an item. By shielding, I know. By blocking attacks, I'm not tainted by those filthy, re he filthy heretics. Precisely. In addition to recovering purity, your guard reduces all damage by 90% for a turn. You should pay attention to one turn cooldown. You should try it now. Okay. One. Wow. See? If I'm hitting while guarding, I can counterattack right away, yes? I already knew all that. Just let me do it myself or else he'll just kill me. Okay. Hierarchy wind. Okay, fine then. Then let me just purge you then. Oh yeah. So now we go to drinks and espresso. Hey no, that's no fair. Feels bureaucracy. Fine. I'll just use my weapon against you. Smake and smashed victory. The world is cleaner now. 15 symmetry achieved, 3 stars collected. Coffee collected as well. Tch. I wonder why this son of Capricorn attacked me right away. Not that my intentions were to spare such heretics, but still. Something is amiss. I must press on. I must press onwards while this goat is still cleaning their boots. Uh, more of them over there. Wannabe salary go. So are you here to join the workers manifesto? Look how cool they are with their katanas and stuff. I hear they even stole grenades. Yes. I hope to join the revolution and hit capit capitalism in the face with my suitcase. Get coffee. Uh, okay, so they're not enemies. Good. Data horoscope. It's a very hazy day. Be sure to guard. When a heretic hits your raised shield, a counter-attack is ensured. There's a great variety of guards and counters depending on which shield you're equipped. You can check more info about your currently equipped battle actions at the abilities menu. Shortcut B. Under actions. Thank you. Shadow go in hiding. Don't scare me like that. Oh wait, Zodax. I purposely did that. You so rebellious. Oh yeah. Oh, you think your little documents are here to save you? Well, unfortunately for you, you're going to be... Oh. You're still alive? I thought I... Ah. You still activated espresso. Coffee that collected. So does that happen every time? So let's just look in our items. So... Industrial Espresso restores one. One? One heart. Oh, one's heart. Okay. I didn't read the plural part. I'm such an idiot. Prize. Uh, Prize. Blank buff. Blank buff. Um, this is why I started on the stress free mode because I need to study the game first before I know what I'm doing. What's all these over here? Better work conditions! The rebellious workers manifesto won't let you pass by. We're no longer your bees, Capricorn! This isn't your hive. Capricorn? What sort of unholiness is she up to? Is she turning against her own servants too? Get out of my way now. I am here to end with your I'm here to end with your leader. No Zadak shall be spared. All hail to glorious revolution! Are you going to be like that? Hmm. Unmotivated. Block. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Fret not, men. We're free. You're not free from my wrath. 
Manifestation struggles. Okay, so that must be a continuous damage thing. Frost! <laughs> Better. Work. Conditions. Ah, yes. Only slightly cleaner. 25 symmetry achieved, 8 stars. So I wonder what these symmetries and achieve stars are. Uh, sorry. What are these, okay, probably stars are ranking and symmetry is currency. Rank up. Virgo stats rose. Equipped ribbon provided a higher velocity. Versatility growth, okay. Um, 11, 5, 17, 9, 27. I need to know the acronyms of those symbols. Right, so let's close. Say first. Then roll out. I wonder how long this is going to be, though. The clock never stops. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. What a slob. <laughs> Dick. Ah, oh, the poor clock. What did I do that for? Maybe that was some sort of Easter egg. Maybe I shouldn't have. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. So I wonder if those horoscopes are random. Or they're set for a particular day. Let's go over here and see what's up. A small shrine to Saturn. Note attached. Welcome to Capricorn Construction Corporation. Our snow is as grey as our hearts. Okay. Thank you for telling me that the gates have been breached. Heretics are down. The temple lies ahead of us. We should revise our plan. Yes, we should check our plan. Alright, so, so we must be at the bottom. And we can jump down from either the left or right. Well, I think it is, or we go underground. Because I think there is two levels there. Um, or there's the most direct route. There's a place on the left side where we are. It seems like Capricorn's way of tradition wouldn't let her change the place for centuries. We'll need to avoid any bright stars we'll find we find around here. Well, so what are the stars? We cannot afford to engage everyone head on. Yes, Virgo needs to stay calm around heretic stars. That's going to be rather difficult. Give it your best. So our main goal is to get to Capricorn's chambers. Our marks are placed with a red X. So what are the purple indicators? But first we need to secure the other blueprints. Those are somewhere around the engine, as our underground engine room. Marked both entrances as well. Both entrances, so, but you'll have to enter the innermost engine alone, Ginger. Yes, I know, I'm useful. I trust you with this, you cannot fail. We all depend on the blueprints. I'd accompany you, but Capricorn results even children work. Result recruits even children to work in there because of how small the pass passages are. How do you find? You can stop worrying so much. I was made for this moment. No, you weren't. You're a cookie. But nevertheless, some places are locked through an engine switch. We should also look for that, just in case this old blueprint doesn't show us the current layout. It is today that this faint constitution will meet its demise. Don't be so confident. Yeah, save after every cutscene, because it's going to be quite important. Reception. Good morning, Virgo. What are your interests in Capricorn Construction Corporation? I came here to seize Capricorn. What? Clear for loudly. To see! We came here to see Capricorn. We have an appointment. Oh, you do? Great. She hates when people disrespect rules. We're very satin... Satian here. I hope you understand. Where is she? I don't have all day. Stop wasting my time, heretic. Um, she's on the last floor of this building, past the garden. You have to go upstairs. Thank you very much, dear sir. I love so. I love saving, so that's why I do that. We can go this way. Snow room. Round, round, very round, round. <laughs> Snowman stares at you relentlessly. You can't see his eyes as he's wearing a good looking pair of glasses. They are very good. Ice cream feedstock. 
What a chilly night. This place reminds me of a cold lake winter in Pisces' land. Sometimes I miss being with Pisces. Since we began our reside with our plan alongside Gemini, she's been absent. She really dislikes violence. You saw her last week! You are getting as forgetful as she is. I know. It's just that I miss us being together with no worries. Are you sure you're ready for this, Ginger? This is going to be hard, a really tough mission for a cookie. Trust me, sometimes I stumble on my feet and fall and... Uh, I can do this. Remember what Gemini said? We have to believe in ourselves. She never said that, Ginger. Must have been Pisces then. That seems more accurate. Gemini would say, get back, my lab rat. Where are you at? Or something like that. Yes, yes. She said that to me when she tried to make my eyes look bigger than a new formula. She did what? She did this. Underneath the shrine to Saturn are a few faint stars scattered around. Oh. I'm still wondering what those stars do. Is it actually experience points? These snowmen are oddly desired. Really. They're probably inspired by Saturn himself. Beneath the shade you can see the snowman has some stars as it eyes. Yes, interact with all the objects to get what I need. Big ice cream feedstock. Can we get anything from that? Ice cream feedstock, ice cream feedstock. Yes. Now we're cooking. Oh, there's something over here actually. Oh, wait. Um. No, I thought that was an object. Obviously, it's not. Coffee one. Well, maybe that's automated. So we come back every day, and it refills us with another one. Blushing Santa, we go. If I drink enough coffee, I may increase my combat cap capabilities, and maybe, just maybe, get Lady Capricorn Senpai to notice me. But mistress, do you have any spare coffee? I found many cups literally five feet from where you sit. Give him some coffee, give him lemonade, or let him dream alone. Forget it, fiend. I wouldn't help a foul spawn of Capricorn even if my life depended on it. Hmm. A book about the Golden Age. The Golden Age was a time of peace and prosperity, where all the constitutions were aligned as one in favour of the greater good, never succumbing to greed. The travels between constitutions can be take can take so could take place easily, and no internal conflicts were tolerated within the realms. However, the great rulers have an enormous amount of power over the Zodak court so Zodak court and the constitutions, causing mutinies coming from several Zodak realms. Those who were against the rulers would be harshly punished by their crimes after being confined in the astrological prison. What a scary place it sounds. There's a book about the ancient rulers of astrology. Sun ruled Leo, Moon ruled Cancer, Mercury ruled Virgo and Gemini. Venus ruled Talarus and Libra. Mars ruled Arius and Scorpio. Jupiter ruled Sat I don't know how to pronounce that and Pescos. And Saturn, the great and just father, ruled over our sublime Capricorn constitution. Aquarius isn't listed here. Apparently she and Capricorn aren't getting along so well. I wonder if Aquarius is disagreeing with her sister's ways again. Not sure, but it's nice to know that. Good. A lovely process. Word Sanogo, this winter has been the coldest. Even though our winter fades as fast as it comes, it's been hard keeping the snow out of the way. There was so much snow that Lieutenant Mesh Meshashi gathered with the lambs to build some snow. We can't afford having any unproductiveness due to this. Not at all. Why? I wonder if helping him would have been nice, been beneficial towards us. Wait. No, 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 you can't go in there. Go through the stars corridor to the right of you. I'm just going to try this one more time. Okay, so I can't go through there. I was wondering if a multiple effect would happen. Bigger engine, bigger worlds. The engine that keeps running. And keeps the world running. Okay. This world is governed by an engine of some sort. Is that Capricorn? 
I've already mobilized the soldiers. Is that Capricorn? How's the worker situation? The workers are making a fuss, currently blocking the entrance, and, well, she's already here. She came early today. As always? Oh, you're the... I'm Virgo, so perfect. But I thought she would still be stuck with Libra's bureaucracies. According to my intel, it seems like Libra released her after Gemini stepped in. She's also in this all by herself. Aquarius isn't involved. I suggest you keep your soldiers at their posts so that the rebel workers slow her down. Hmm? You're Capricorn, it would seem. Yes! We could have her clean up. Clean them up. So clean them up for us instead. It's more efficient that way. Tch. <laughs> She'll be smoshed before you can even count to ten. Okay, thank you very much for that. What lovely art to this game. Like, really, really beautiful art. I mean, I always maintain that story comes first before art, but art just makes it so much prettier. Excuse me. Daily horoscope is such a stale theorist day. Attacks and abilities are tied to the zodiac qualities of Cardinal Mutterbulb and fixed. Each of those qualities uses a certain stat to calculate both offense and defensive capabilities. For example, the ambition stat increases all cardinal damage inflicted and reduces all cardinal damage received. You do you see this? You say some kind of attacks. Right, so let's press onwards. So, did you have a map of this place? Okay, here's the blueprint. So, I would say we are currently heading towards the center. We couldn't go front. Hmm. There's also... Oh, this is quite slow along here, isn't it? According to the blueprints, this place is sealed through an, en an engine room switch. What? We couldn't go. We couldn't have gone straight on from the entrance because that way's blocked. Avoid stars. Database center. It's a very busy day, but which is also buffs and stats. Drink eliminator increase your velocity for two turns. Uh, cool. Thank you. So where would one be in this current scenario right now? Dormitories. You there, help me. Yes, you, help me. What if I don't want to? What if I just want to press on oh, this way? Those don't look too pretty. This appears to be locked. Okay, fine. What if I just... What are these? What's that there? Oh, what a nice specimen we have here. Look at that bright hair, girl. Your wig is to die for. This is not a wig, heretic. Oh, is that so? You should be proud. I'm so sorry for this discourtesy. I should have introduced myself first. I am beyond. Friends beyond. As you might have possibly noticed, I'm stuck in the wall. And I'm going to give you the unique opportunity of saving me from this nightmare. Since you're such a babe. I'm in the way of becoming the next big superhero actor on Adelbrand's products with passes. You should go and see our play. Help me out and I'll give you a ticket to the most incredible experience you'll have in a lifetime. Don't fear your destiny. Pull friends out of a wall. This is going to be a trap. You have my thanks, stranger. Here, take a ticket. Best player of a ticket. This wall is treacherous, so be careful. I was trying to grab my to-do list that got stuck in the wall and Sarah became its next victim. I came here to pick up a parcel for Tartarus, Tar Tartarus the Sleepwalker. I'd forgotten if it wasn't for my to-do list. And you just disappeared like that? Fine. This isn't a snowman. This is a snowwoman. Okay, thanks for that. 
Now we got a lovely ticket. Appears to be locked. So what do you want? A major satin statue stands valiantly in the middle of a sleep room. So you said you want me, so why did you call for me? Or maybe it was the other thing that called for me. According to Miss Clock, the workers may only sleep for two hours a day before resuming work. Wow. What a horrible sleep. I would I would demand for more time. One thing this cold environment makes you makes your heart skip a beat. Ah, oh, we could actually heal there, it seems. Excellent. Database center. Crayon vases of relic of the golden age. General Deneb Agai will find this unacceptable. Lieutenant Minshashi break the clock again, trying to fix its engine. His hands are too big. Clockwork system broken by Lieutenant. Lieutenant did that. Rarely used Saturn Shrine. Spiders find it to be the perfect place to bring their families. Save dinosaur. Hello, I am Mr. Eight Dinosaur. By getting to know me, you can now save the game. I could already do that before. Exactly. That's thanks to our family. All my brothers and sisters are now extinct. But not me. No, I ran. Thanks, Tick. This window shows only a wall. Bland. Just like the sound of Ghost Future. How bland is that? <laughs> Beyond image is a before imagining the engine fuels production. Do not touch is written atop the boxes. They've been here for at least a decade. Sano goes are very obedient. It's so dusty. Clean it in the name of purity. What a relief. It's so much cleaner now. Proves you challenged the orders. Unacceptable. An obedient Sano guy starts by attacking. Block attack. Is the only way forward. Drinks an espresso. How is that on parallel? <laughs> what is clean up? A coffee collected. This place is unreal. Well, I'm glad that those are clean. At least this box is clean now. Yes. Be almighty clean. Randy Snowman is losing shape as the heat is becoming unbearable to snowy creatures. Oh dear. Locked. Okay, we need to find a key for that. So I wonder what the keys will look like. Sales go, somebody gotta earn some money from this. I would like to buy some things, please. Uh, I would like... Uh, have some soap. Okay, so what we've got is 29 is our current currency, and minus is how much we're spending. So I'm gonna buy two soaps. Apparently it says, oh, that's just the price we're at, mate. And I'm just buying things which I haven't got. And I can't hold any more items. Good for me. Wait, I think I've already have so. Hold on. No, abilities. Action. No. Bag. Okay, here we go. Yeah, bag. So we must have a cap towards how many items we can hold. Moves 99% of purities. And lowers costs. Okay. Manual. This is my C to 16. Okay, thanks. The part of the engine it runs through all the realm. Every single piece of this land is bound by the grand engine. I could take this coffee only carrying too many of these. Are you sure you're carrying too many of these? Okay, I can't. I've already had one, that's why. Free sample! I'll take it. Books about the De Deneep Algae stock market. It's Capricorn's brightest star. Well, this isn't such an achievement 
This is a faint constitution, after all. It's dying, but the salary goes keep going, working relentlessly. It's no wonder we find those rebels at the entrance. Anyone can recognize a faint constitution when they see it. Now Capricorn struggles in this eternal search for power of hers. When even some of these workers recognize the abuse they're going through, disgraceful. Poor salary goes. Uh, dear. Someday, mark my words, I'll be the best go round. Much coolness. I'm filled with ambition. We cardinals are like that. <laughs> I'm a work of mind. Okay. You will tap away. The milk farm is fine for now. It is because we take good care of it. Sense of migration. Oh, between the gold age, golden age and to our current liberal capitalist system, we found a huge difference. On our cooperative relationships between the constitutions, now there's a lot more zodiacs demanding our supplies. Without those old and complicated commercial agreements set up by the rulers, we can deliver a better service on an even larger demand. Lady Capricorn even brought us our own Zeppelin. So that we know of anything and anyone who enters and leaves this building. Well, it's a shame that I entered here, isn't it? There's a bag with far too many cookies atop the table. Eat the cookies! Sure. Fully recovered. Heresy count one. Okay. Okay, heresy count. Is that going to be a factor that's going to be in the game? There should be like a symbol or something on the save point where um, if you encounter a heresy point, then that happens. Seems like it's our paper, that's fine. Wonder what the heresy points do. Don't you see I'm doing nothing? I'm very proud of it. I wish I could fill this form faster. Lady Capricorn could have built us with four arms that have been boring too, we have. They say we should rebel, but for what reason? We have plenty of milk in here. Don't tell Lady Capricorn about this, but I think James has a crush on her. Who the heck's James? General asks for a report on the taxes rises. There's a note inside that reads, if every item was free, item producers would go bankrupt. Support your local economy. Should I? Hmm. You're asleep! I hate when he sleeps on top of my keyboard! According to BN Analytics, our website has lost 4% of the traffic due to the change of our layout. Meshashashi Sama keeps staring at my monitor as I try to avoid doing my tasks. Maybe you should do your tasks. Here the workers keep all the documents that weren't finished on schedule. There's no documents in it. This looks like wood, but it's actually made with diamonds. Oh dear. Hiya! Get out of my way, fiend. I have an appointment with Capricorn and I must head through this specific door. I think Kenji is asleep. Kenji? Is this the name of this filthy ugly creature? I'm not sure, but it would be a perfect name for a samurai. He's a samurai, right? I would like to have a name like that. Do you want to be called Kenji from now on? Not at all. I prefer the name you gave me. I'm glad you like it, my friend. Can you please check the blueprints again? He's too big to be pushed away from the door. Hmm. There's another door that can lead us to the engine room. But that one is locked, as you said. Well, we can always try and break it. Nothing that some violence can't solve. Although I would like to save all my energy to a Capricorn. Virgo, look. Hmm. A possible threat. Tired center of them. I'd like to order a very cold coffee, please. Now's our chance to get in without drawing too much attention. Can we go around? I think going around would be a bad mistake. We're going to sneak through. Go this way. And something on mock. Uh, a shiny item covered bow tie stands out in this particular snowman design. 
Yeah, take it with me. The fat cold spear of a snowman didn't really seem bothered by your petty theft. Oh, so the snowman gave you a new weapon? Awesome! Go, go, equipped it! I failed to understand the point of this. Why should I change my outfit? With this, your stats will go differently. And they'll give you new rad abilities. On top of that, you'll look even better once you rank up. Each new piece of equipment hides its own mysteries. It's amazing. You can press E to quickly access your equipment. If I can kill a greater quantity of heretics with such a headdress, then I'll wear it. Okay, such things are there. Hmm. So, yep, our uh, ambition cycle is raised while versatility and cuteness decreases. Okay, so what are these guys in? Mr. Gunn, what are you doing about ribbon, miss? You can't go around undressing our snowman like this. The snowman definitely didn't bother to take it back. Now get out of my sight, I have an appointment. No, no, mistress. You look a tad suspicious. I must report to General Deeb. You dare interrupt me, heretic. Do you know why one does not interrupt Mer G Virgo twice? Why is that? Because we are dead after the first try. Okay. Oh, boy. You definitely made him mad. Back off, Ginger. This one looks like he knows his way in combat. But Gemini asked me to read you her Zoda at Qualities 101. Yeah. You tried to defend your attacks the same way you did, Virgo. I'd be blind if I hadn't seen that. Good thing he's got a red shield instead of a green one. That means he's got extra protection against red fixed damages. Why are you talking in color codes? Am I in kindergarten again? This is such a waste of patience. No, no, no. He's the one trying to rely on his own patience. If you didn't notice before, I did. All abilities are tied to preserve that quality system. What did I do to deserve such lectures? It's simple, really. If you got more patience, all your fixed skills will do, fixed skills will do, will do more damage. And you take less damage from fixed skills as well. I got none like that. It doesn't matter. Qualities come... Uh, so qualities form a convoluted relationship with each other. The chart goes like this. Um, which means that fixed focus foes will take extra mutable damage while Cardinal will take extra damage from fixed attacks and multiple heretics will rarely reduce Cardinal damage I already got that back when I was 5 that's because you're super smart and pre precious and this is why I can't get mad at you ENOUGH TALK MISS Jab Capricorn spawn will often try to strike at you with Cardinal attacks you made the right decision to bring such an ambitious shield of you I told you already know the basics. Bruh! Here, yeah, drink this. Okay, I won't interrupt you. Promise. Thank you. Okay, so this must be super effective then. Reckoning. Opening cardinal guarantees a critical hit on the next turn. Okay. Smite. 32. Okay. So you attack again? Fine. Um, shield. Can you bring down my shield? Fine. Victory. The world is now cleaner, and we got more from that. Serves him right. Serves him right, most certainly. So, bring that back up. You also got some health increase as well. Well, health recovery. Increase means that the, the base is increased. According to the blueprints, this place is sealed for an engine room switch. Ah, so we go slow along here but faster downwards. Very good. But where did that little guy come from though? I'm just wondering that. Hmm, mystery. Ah, we can go here now. No! You can't enter here right now. Shush, get out. I won't tell you twice. I knew that violence was the only choice. <laughs> oh boy, such persistence. 
Are you sure you can really fight, little creature? No, we're going to face it. Yes, I can do anything for Mother. Fine. But I shall smite you! <laughs> Admittedly, the world is cleaner now. Stop, please. I fainted. I fainted. Well, if you fainted, then why are you still walking around? I'm already carrying too many of these. Oh, so coffee is a thing. Okay. Okay, so we can only carry five coffee. Maybe we can only carry five of each. Inside a cupboard, there are some fireworks. Celebrate Heretics Disgrace with deafening fireworks. Offensive item, then. We can use that in battle, then. Good. Let's keep going, then. Daily Hull Ship is a very static day. As well as granting abilities and base stats, each piece of equipment has different effects based on their slot. Weapons and shields will provide specific attacks and guard counters, respectively. Some which may appear debuffs to enemies hit or steal heart or purity. Armors passively reduce damage received from enemies, boosts help avoid debuffs. But above all else, ribbons worn in the head are extremely important. When equipped, ribbons will de de ribbons will define Virgo's stat growths. Each are geared towards a specific quality and raise patience, ambition and versatility when you wank up. Wear ribbons carefully, as their bonuses are permanent. Yep. A piece of the engine must be less functional. This mechanis mechanical masterpiece is powered by raw ambition. Good. This one doesn't print money. Oh, corner machines! Why do you have to shout? It's a very colourful day. You may discern what zodiac qualities are used. So, which zodiac qualities are used? by each enemy by their colouring clothes. If an enemy is dressed in greenish manner, they'll surely try to taint you with vers versatile abilities. Their defensive stats will like match their offensive powers as well, making it better published, but will take less damage from cardinal attacks and abilities you use on them. Some stronger enemies who wear a variety of colours will also use more than one quality when they attack. Storage Keeper. These lights, they blind me. They said we can, can't turn them off. What, can I smite them? That would be very handy. You hear strange noises coming from the inside of motors of this wonderful car. And naturally strange noises. What does that mean though? What do you want? Virgo loses ambition. Okay, so that is actually something bad. Hmm. Loses ambition. So maybe interacting with that multiple times decreases my stats. The door seems to be locked. It is all. Is it all set, Henry? Three, two, one. Boom. Hmm. We did it, Henry. Go. Call the others. Our next target is General Denneby. Wait a second. There's a Zodak here. Light up your grenades. Heretics. Okay, light up your grenades. Right. I'll deal with you all in due time. <laughs> so what will these grenades do though? Oh, we received a burn. That's not good. That might decrease my health over time. Good. One of them is... Okay, we'll go fires are out. Okay, so that can go away naturally, that's all good. Weapon against you. Ooh. Sets up some explosives. Good. Victory. The world is cleaner now with these heretics gone. Dynamite collected. Excellent. 
So that just cleared away for us. So that's excellent. Excellent indeed. Henry seems to have dropped his shoes. Equip now, yes. So what do these shoes do? Status. We need something for armor though. Equipment equipped. So basically, it's a boot. It's um, it's an increase in patience and cuteness. That's all there is to it. Complicated and useless data about milking milk production. <laughs> okay, I almost said something really bad there. I think I did. Milk production, not milking. <laughs> About 50 living rats are inside. Okay. Those poor little rats. A large box filled with ice cream, a speciality of these lads. Little bucket of water. Usually used to clean the floor. Finally, a useful object in this heinous mayhem. Yummy. Oh, got plus one yogurt. It's already broken down. Uh, cleanse the intestines to remove all debuffs and recovers HP. That. Uh, equipment. Uh, abilities. Level for sugar. Raw milk container, Capricorn profits from goat milk and construction materials. Perhaps the soaps I find in here may as well be produced with milk, but perhaps the purity has never been so disgusting. Box milk ready to be exported. Storage. Okay, we've got too many copies, so we'll use one now. Take a copy. Mm, these hens are here. That's three red wires and two blue wires connected through a single yellow wire. I quite said that's what sorry, I said that's wrapped around with one gear. Stand back, girl. We're trying to end capitalism here. You're in my way, heretic. You barbaric waste matter not to me now. Let me pass and you and your friend won't be harmed except for your egos. The revolution cannot wait, girl. Oh, you're lighting up your grenade again. Well, screw yeah, you're not going to be doing that. Okay, so the red ones won't do that much good. Um, yes, let's create an opening. Excellent. Well, that's critical here anyways. Just keep attacking this thing. Excellent. Virgo is now rank 3. Excellent rank up. There goes that rose. Equipped ribbon provide a higher ambition growth. <laughs> Empty just like Capricorn's heart, oh dear. So we've got a different colour sprite now. What a mess. Let's not interrupt too many of those. It appears to be locked. Oblivious go assistance. General placement in our glorious constitution is at tail. And General Dab here is ahead. But this has nothing to do with that note in the engine piece. This is just pure poultry made by the workers' manifesto. They are very good at performance arts. Their latest piece was called From Self to Space Rhythm. Okay. A file name. I already carry too many of these, that's fine. We can just use one of these then. Bob. Coffee. Coffee for the soul. I'm heading towards the glorious engine now to report those sab Sabocha's explosive activities to General. Finally, I'll get my promotion. What if I go through there? Will that disturb anything? Hang on, let's just go around here to see if there's anything. Daily horoscope is a very explosive day. In addition to their purity cost, every ability has limited uses in battle. To 
to so those uses vary greatly and may also apply to some abilities enemies use. When soap restores every ability used in battle as well as reduces your purity costs, all uses are restored after battle even if you even if you flee or lose. Small salary. We gotta send Pascus a grand a total for mixed six sh sh shipments of hats, rabs and rafts, but one is missing. One is missing. What the hell can we do? You thread your arm deeply in a box. Right at the bottom you find shiny festive material. It seems that this box has been returned here from its first delivery. According to the note glued to it, Taurus wasn't satisfied with the quality of exported ice cream. Hello dearie. Virgo loses ambition. Again? What? I don't know what... I don't know how we lose it. I thought first of all we lose it because we interacted with that crackling engine. Oh. Mad celebrate. Oh man, I'm pumped. My shift is over. It's over. Let's celebrate. Okay. Be like that, man. And you are defeated, friend. One friend. How to type first, volume 34, how to type fast, winter version, and how to type real fast, volume 2 limited edition. Parcel. Yes. Parcel for secondhand goods that sell for a large amount. Yes. What's the point of a lock then if I can just simply go around? It's still unclear now as to why that's locked. And why do we keep losing ambition as well? It's supposed to be locked. Blow it up! Used one dynamite. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, we did that. No one's going to believe me and my awesomeness. How did you open that door? Um, I opened it because I'm awesome. You seem to be a bit tougher than the other one I faced. Fine. Be like that, Ben. Stomping on the ground won't do you good. Oh yeah, heretic removed. You will now face dangers beyond imagining, imag although I couldn't stop you. The glorious revolution will. Shut up. More paperwork. I'm confused already. Suitcase. Your suitcase filled with many confusion bureaucratic. bureaucratic. I forgot how to pronounce it now. Bureaucratic documents. Good. Just a fight. So it's just a fake closet. Doors don't even open. Thank you. Okay, we'll go downstairs then. Go downstairs. Wait, just look at our save thing. Yeah, this is the first time. Maybe because I got the purple ribbon in my arm rather than the gold one. The engines. So this is where we need to be, apparently. Oh. I've seen you got yourself a parcel. I'll give you 35 for it. Yep, you can have it. I don't need it. To function properly, the engine must harvest power constantly for source from sources unknown. It's a very mechanical day. Your secondary stats are cycle, destiny, and cuteness. Cycle represents the cyclic si nature of the world, increasing the damage of critical hits. Heretics with higher cycles in you will strike faster. Destiny controls who lives or die. All healing item healing for items and skills depends on the user's destiny. Cuteness creatures are softer and better for hugging. Okay, this is blocking your path. Well, can I blow it up? Or do I need dynamite for that? Gravity is shifting. I sense a strong presence nearby. Gravity is shifting. There are nine tabs open in the CC browser. Thirty-five tabs open in the CC browser. Hey, there's a switch over there on the left. Dare ye all. Hmm. Corner machines. Middle machines. Machines. Gears. Yep. 
Can't you follow one simple order? You two are useless. Useless. We, we are terribly sorry, General. We're fully awake now, see? See? And don't you even think about turning the lights off again. But please don't tell Lady Capricorn. What? You dare ask me for favours? Shoot and get back to work. Now. No. We just want to sleep a little. Lady Capricorn will get really mad at us. The general was right. Or maybe she's just a general rather than being Lady Capricorn herself. We are so incompetent and sleepy. Halt! Where's your permission card to access the engine room? We forgot to ask permission from the pink lady and general got really mad. We won't let you pass without a perm. Oh, you won't. Let us see. Okay, we are here again. A reckoning is at hand. Oh, that was really big. Uh, shield. Oh, you pulled down my shield. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah, this is going to be quite long, it would seem. Uh, the green ones do more damage. Shield. You keep putting down my shield. How dare you. Oh. Patience. Just do it naturally event. Oh yeah. <laughs> the world is cleaner. Wine collected. I'll happily accept it, but what can I do with it? Apart from consumer, in fact. Because if she went up that way... That would be too obvious to press. Let's explore the rest of the facility first. Daily horoscope is a very mechanical day. During combat, you may be afflicted with several kinds of debuffs that may alter basic attributes or harm you with additional effects. The most, uh, co the most common attribute debuffs are impatience immaturity and unmotivated, which respectively lower patients with acidity or ambition by 40%. Other kinds of debuffs include poison, confusion, burn, and or many others. Poison inflicts damage over time and cannot be removed naturally, while burn only lasts for up to four turns. Any kind of damage inflicted by a debuff is calculated by the user's destiny stat. So it would be wise to increase our destiny to decrease the damage caused by poison and burn. It's always time for glorious revolution. What do you got carrying? Too many coffees. Coffee is unmoxed here. Good. Okay, so these guys want to play nice. Well, not play at all. They're just harmful. Let's remove these then. Work conditions aren't getting any better, but we are getting worse. The rebellious workers' manifesto won't let you pass. The workers no longer struggle to focus on the issue at hand. Okay. Oh yeah. Hmm. Be like that, man. You keep protesting, but it's not going to be good for you. Critical hit. You might be free, but it's not going to do you any good. Oh, they are actually quite, actually quite distasteful. These guys are better work conditions. Yeah, that's all good for our behalf. I think we should use soap sparingly. Suitcase, something along the lines. Good for us. We could go up there, or we could go around and see what's up over here. There's another switch over here. You should save your game sometime soon, Mistress Spiergo. Thank you for the advice. Who even built this place? Yeah, who even built this place to have so many different obstacles? Let's defeat all of them then. I think we'll get the most out of all of this if we just... If we just defeat every single one of these guys. Let's go up here then. You. 
I care not for the revolution. My purpose is solely to profit regardless of occasion. Bye. Oh, we could set up an explosive. We'll count. We'll, we'll buy two of those. Um, just in case, actually. And. And. There we go, actually. You know, we did good there. That was a very good purchase. Save. All the almighty glorious save. We'll burn the place to the ground. I will obey anyone who doesn't stand with a worker's manifesto. Okay. Feynman. I get your mischievous ways. <laughs> it might be unparalleled strength, but I still manage to resist that. <laughs> yes. Excellent. Now, stomp. Ah ha ha ha, I stunned ya. Excellent. Going for the kill. The world is cleaner now, but it's removed. Oh, you're still there, huh? Maybe I need to remove you then. Get away. I'm not fighting again. Oh, okay. This one doesn't fit precisely in the corners. It's not worthy of its name. Okay. An armored chest piece seems to be stuck in a hack. You require at least 15 ambitions to take it off. Okay. Good for us. We managed to do it. Equip now. Oh, yeah. Now we have some armor. Hmm. Very heavy armor reduces by 10% and gives a chance to debuff on hit. So, basically, oh, that gives us resistance, not decreases our uh, attack power. Okay, that's all good. So all these are quite purple, they're quite ambition-based. Okie dokie. I'd like to have one of probably every single one of them, you know. One of green, one of red, one of purple, one of brown, one of blue and probably the cuteness out of it my hands are tired of so much savage whatever it's called corner machines okay so i'm glad we picked up our armor that's all really good so let's flick three switches now and see what's happen what's going to happen first one up here something appeared on the, con on the switch control panel Ah, it just creates those places to become not locked down. But we went around anyways because I like having as much stat boost as possible. I'm not the sort of... Okay, but it shows a map indicating that two dolls have been unlocked in the building. This map makes no sense. It's completely different from ours. It's like an old version of the place. We can't trust this. Okay. I should save my game. Well, if you say so, I'll save it. Most certainly. there. It spawns us all the way over there. Okay. We'll keep going along here then. Oh, hi there. I knew it. I knew it. The clerk told me about your little appointment. Talking about seizing mother and destroying our work environment. He sent you in the wrong direction so he could buy me some time. And you really came to the engine. At least you helped me clean the pathetic manifesto. Ugly maid. Now shush, Virgo. Go away, shush, shush. You won't get anywhere near your objective. Mother Capricorn entrusted me this position. I'll protect the blueprints. Shoo, shoo. Oh, so the blueprints are really located in here? You never miss a spot, Ginger. You didn't know. How come? But you... You were heading to the central engine room. Well, Ginger had a hunch about... Uh, sorry, had a hunch after checking our map on the temple's blueprints. But seeing you here, Danby... Uh, okay. 
the shining star in its faint constitution. What a displeasable, over amusing sight. Hmm. <laughs> what are you even grinning about? Denny is a binary system, you dummy. You even dare enter the temples of Saturn with this ridiculous purity quest of yours? You came to wipe out our dirtiness? All hail the great maid of the Zodak. Boo. What are you talking about? How do you know about my righteous crusade? Do you really think Gemini could keep her mouth shut? <laughs> sister. You are Mons Capricorn's personal guards and you're standing here. You are obviously trying to buy her time. Why does it matter to you? You couldn't care less for anything other than yourself and that precious mother of yours. This isn't about the damage you attempt to do to other constitutions. Our insurance will cover that. This is about me and my potential promotion. If I keep this place safe from the likes of you, Mother is sure to reward me. So if I may be closest to her, I'll finally force Mishishushi to step down. I shall let you keep dreaming about your promotions, child. However, all the Constitution's blueprints, we ought to take them. Oh no, no, you wouldn't. You have to get out of here right now or feel, you'll feel my wrath. Mother Capricorn won't be pleased, and I won't waste any more working hours with you, maid. Oh, fear not, for I will keep you waiting no longer. This shall be quick. Stay behind me, Ginger. Blood is about to be shed. Ah, 180 it would be. Let's try stunning. Oh, I've been poisoned. That's no good. Um, need to strategize about this because it's going to be a pretty tough fight, I would suppose. Um, do I have anything that will actually you know what? Um, set up an explosion. Do I have anything that removes poison? Use no time to abuse and lowers costs. Okay, I've set up a firework on you. Cute, cute, I'm going to cut you all in pieces. Best mommy's day gift ever. Watch as I turn you into hideous stardust, infidel. Defense down. Oh no. Sheesh. Okay, so the poison has been averted. But that actually gives us a bit of a disadvantage. So shall we shield for the time being? Oh, again with the poison. Unmotivated, nice. Defense more normalizes. Um, smite. Survive an next attack. Oh, cleans your intestines, remove all debuffs, and recovers heart. I should have used that first of all. Um, apply buff to that. Excellent. Now I feel ambitious. And you used a reboost as well, damn it. Um, more, more for that, where that came from. Increases crit chance, but decreases hit rate. Right, so our history drops in. Um, deafening, set up an explosion. Suitcase for me, confusing. We need to keep actually. Um, shield. Defense down then. <laughs> You're desperate. All good for me. Oh, you are weak. No longer fit for your job. You didn't protect a fiend, not even your pitiful excuse of a star. You, dis you dishonored Capricorn with such weakness. No, we end her misery. Quiet, it is I who will decide when to stop fighting. I'll protect Mother until my heart stops beating. 
You chose this life and shall be granted your death wish of taking your job to the grave. Be on guard. You will receive no mercy. <laughs> you are desperate. But now your time has come to an end. Why can't I do anything right? Mother, I tried so hard and I'm not supposed to be the best. I am the binary system. I am, or was, the star of this constitution. Victorious. The world is cleaner now. <laughs> there goes now ranked four. Rank up. There goes stats rose. Equipped ribbon provided a higher ambition growth. Our ambition rises. Hmm? Place is shaking. Wow, a fallen star. Can I make a wish already? Who are you, Mast One? You can't wish upon a sad star. Shall I make them happy before they die? That's too hard. No one is happy when you pierce their eyes and rip their head off. I can't reveal myself. Otherwise, I wouldn't be wearing a mask. But this is Mr. Apica. Mr. is very shy and not very fond of introductions. This lady is very suspicious. No, I'm not. I came here only after my wish. Step back, you two. What should I do with this body? I really hate when I when they don't disappear. Nothing good comes from King and Star. Even the most dissidable ones deserve to rest in peace. Somewhere in space. Where am I? What was that light? Where's Ginger? Ginger! Where are you? Ginger! 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 Hey. Hey, Zodak. Over here. Jump around. See if you can find your way up here. I'll be waiting for you. Just make it quick. The pressure in here is nuts. Pressure. Well, if you say so, I shall do my damned most. Can I jump? Daily horoscope is nebula day. Due to gravitational field revolving around a supernova, you may jump much further than you normally can. But because of that, you can't perform any diagonal jumps. Horizontal and vertical jumps are possible in any direction. Press A to jump. That's very useful. Okay. Okay. So I need to plan this carefully. Go over here. Can't go over there, so I have to go back over here. I can't go over there, though. That's the problem. Go over here, here, back over here. Seems like we're just back at the start, aren't we? Seems like it. Maybe it was optional to go back here. Go backwards. Can I interact with this dear dinosaur? Nope, I can't interact with a dear dinosaur. It's stuck there. I can't go over there. There's this mysterious portal, though. Why are we here? Is it because we were near... Blank when she died? It must be. It's always so uncomfortable being inside the supernova. She bright and so moisty. Have you witnessed a supernova event before? Yes. It's always this cold, but being in the early winter of the Capricornian lands is even colder. How can we get out of here? I need to go off the Capricorn and my companion. I'm not so sure. Supernovas are still time-space conundrums for me. There is a way, though. It's tricky, but very possible. Activate one of her memories, and it's possible for you to open a gate. Every supernova carries a chain of memories. You just need to take one with you, and the supernova will crumble. Now is my cue. Thank you. Ugh. This is a symmetric place. Of course this is the work of her. I should get out of this men and hockey as quickly as possible. I didn't say that right again. What 
was over there. I found it! The core! And it is mine! So much for this little feeny. The masked person embraces the fading core of, uh, of Blank. This is our farewell, Virgo of the Zodiac. May our destinies never align again. Wait! I still have unanswered questions. She's gone. I need to get out of here quick. The pressure is getting too low for a Zodiac. Jo what the heck is that attacking us, so? Maybe it's continuous. Over here, something. This is a stock market calculator. Limited edition has more numbers than the normal minds could possibly fathom, mainly carrying with star one, me one memory. Um, um, I'll take the Aquamarine Halberd. I shall take the Aquamarine Halberd, please. Once removed, it may never be put back. Take it. When in touch, a fragment of his memory is exposed. Now with Pierce's Halbert, I'll finally beat Mamushi as his own game. No more second places for me. No more. Deneep, what are you muttering alone in there? No, I think. Just let me be. You wouldn't understand. Are you in a bad mood again? Perhaps I can bring you some cold coffee? No, no, shush, I don't want company. But James brought a new coffee med no, sorry, coffee machine. It tastes a little better, I guess. It's just, I... Excuse me. Bring me a warm one, warm one today, please. If I do, can I sit here with you? We could drink together. Yeah. She really did steal Pierce's weapon. I need to report that to her. Pressure again. Uh, oh my. Space is getting really visible. Okay, I thought that was an item which we, we could use, but obviously not. Okay, this place is now distorted. The pressure is getting abnormal. Oh my, memory of her. Visions of her. What a horrific plane of events to be in his this space. God. Space is always so fascinating to me. Ginger. Nope. Hallucination. Gingerbread, gingerbread man, come here now. I'll kill you when I find you. I'll tear you apart for making me worry so this much. Ginger, I beg of you, please answer me. Where are you? Please answer. This isn't right, Ginger. I calculated every part of our plan. It would be perfect. My head is spinning. The air. Ginger, please answer. This is all my fault. I shouldn't have brought Ginger here. I shouldn't. I need to find a way out of this place. Keep going on. This is the only way forward. When's the last time we saved? There now. A portal. Some moments later, back at the entrance. Engine corridor. Virgo, you're back! Ginger, you're alive and well! And still symmetrical! Ah, how much I miss this symmetry! My perfect cookie. Wah, Virgo, I'm gonna break if you hold me like this. Where are, where were you? I was really worried. It all went boom and then you disappeared. I was sucked into the supernova void. This is a rather unique event, but sometimes it happens. I couldn't predict it, my friend. I'm so sorry. It's okay, I can forgive you. You are here now. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for being perfectly fine. I want to be able to proceed without you. And about our mission. Nah. No, no! I can I can do it. I can. You have to trust me. I am the only one who can enter the central engine. It's too tight for you. But what if something like this happens again? It's obvious that I can't predict perfectly calculate the odds anymore. It won't happen. I trust you. 
You came back for me, right? So please trust me. I'll do everything right. I'll be friendly to everyone. You told me that the salary lambs are cute. They may be Capricorians, but they are also very kind indeed. See? Everything will go perfectly. Just trust me on this one. The blueprints have been correct until now. There aren't any other binaries like blank in this constitution. Just because Dalba is traveling and... See? She's away. The odds will be in our favor. Fine. Do as we planned. But be extremely careful. EXTREMELY CAREFUL! I will. You would probably kill me otherwise. Trust that I would. Just stay alert to your surroundings. And absolutely don't tell anyone about our plan or let us know our true intentions. Righty! You have to be quick in there. Meet me at the Saturn Devotion Center afterwards. You've checked the blueprint left and right. You know how to get out. Yes, I memorized it. Thank you for entrusting this to me at Virgo. Thank you for helping me. And don't forget to get the blueprints there. They must be hidden somewhere in the engine. I will. Everything will go perfectly in the end. Just as planned. Here we go. Be careful. I will, I will. Oh my, we have a cookie visitor. Hello, what are you doing here, Mr. Cookie? No one is allowed to enter the engine except for us. Us, what do you mean? Yes, us children of Capricorn. We are very little with tiny hands, so we fit inside the engine perfectly. Isn't that child labor and prohibited? Yes, but we live in a dystopian society where nothing is prohibited, prohibited if it's productive. Do you need any help? In fact, yes, I do. I really need to get my friend from here to there. Oh my, that's going to be tough. Hey everyone! Mr. Cookie needs our help. Hello? Do you need a cookie, Mr. Cookie? We have plenty. No, 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 sorry, man. It's not polite to offer cookies to a cookie. I am sorry. It won't happen again. I am sorry. So, Mr. Cookie needs to get his friend from here to there. Oh my, that's going to be tough. Yes, I just said that. You must unlock all the switches to keep the traps from harming your friend. They must be activated in order or else it will not work. We need to combine our efforts to make it work. Use the big red button in the middle of the room to check if your friend is doing okay. Come on boys, we have a cookie to help here. Okay, I can't save while being this. Big red button. Would you want to read it somewhere? I guess it has something to do with cuteness, Ginger. Level 1 activated. All other levers are now inactive. Yes, we can proceed through now. On, the, on to the next one, Ginger. Oh, I need you to... Okay, so you're stuck there, I imagine. Hello, I am a save dinosaur. Want to save your game? Yes, we haven't saved since before the boss fight. I was dead worried. Breaking the fourth wall there. There are 99 tabs open. Wait. I told you there would be dinosaurs. I don't believe in them. Okay. Printer! I'll tell you this one thing. Salman needs to stop writing all caps on top of these. His excitement infuriates me. Really now. If the salary, man, the salary lambs can't see outside, they'll have nothing to envy. Okay. The Saturn Shrine is never used. The salary lambs are still learning to pray. Savamo's salary. Man. Salary lamb. I'm learning how to read so I can correct Salomon's mistakes as well. I can sit down in all places. 
I need that guy to move. What? You said the switch button was broken. Hold on, let me fix it by typing some words on my keyboard. There, I fixed it with the power of technology. If it was that simple, why was it broken in the first place? You may never question science. Yes, I understand that, but this guy is still not moving. Like, you're in the way. Do something, Ginger. I'll try my best, but this guy is literally in the way in this big box of milk. Milk. Can't have a difference, the same engine, but with a different purpose. I need something. Never offered me a cookie. Don't sleep on the job. No, said I. I've heard our pretty Lady Capricorn hasn't let any any scissor near her hair for, like, that long. Okay. All the names start with an S because that's the way of life. New engine pass. That's three red wires, now two blue wires connected with a single yellow wire. And that wrapped around that one gear, which then makes everything worse everywhere. Why though? Hmm. I still want to give you a cookie I made. I think it might be very tasty. Accept a piece for your own of your own material. Thank you! Neither of them are smart as workers, I get confused by those levers. All I know is that it must be activated like 1, 2, 3, and 4, and I guess it's 4. They start counting from right to left because Mother Capricorn is left handed. Once any lever is activated, you should go to the big bu red button right after. You should ask around to see if there's anyone who can help you activate them. I'll stay here and make sure your friend doesn't die. Thank you! Yeah, okay, next one. What now, Virgo? Try asking around, Ginger. Someone over there must know how to stop these traps. Right. Hmm. Okay. So, there must be a fist going up and down. There are three activated. All of the levers are now inactive. Ginger, there's a dragon in here, although it's rather static. Are you in danger? I'm on my way to the last switch. Take your time, it definitely doesn't approach me. Okay. Uh, 821. There we go. <laughs> What's the situation of this? good. We're all good to go. That's it. The portal to Capricorn's room is right here. I can see it. Come, Ginger. Yes. The Star's Corridor. Oh, by mercy's wits. What is going on? Where am I? Where's Ginger? Not here, it would seem. Okay. There's an inscription above this door. It reads, Those of lesser intent beware. The noblest door lies before you. Only sheer ambition will sh shall open it to endless greatness. And apparently, this won't be enough to those with less than 50 ambition. Hmm. So we've got only 38, so we need to find a way of getting more ambition. Okay, okay. Hi there. How did you get here? Isn't she the lady who's going around the corporation killing our men, drinking our coffee? My journey is righteousness. You have no say in it, in it heretics. She called us a bad name, George. She said it. You bet that's an insult. You get into combat position, huh? Fine. Uh, smite by my name. Critical yet. The board is now cleaner. Oh man, what am I going to do now? George was the only one who, who thought of all the good tactics. 
Uh, shield it up. You take a defense stance, huh? Fine. Although it did resist. God, you jabs. Thrust. <laughs> Cleaner now. Without you around, that is. Hmm. Coffee plus one, that's all good. Yes, equipped! That's a purple sign. So that must mean that our ambition is now at 50! <laughs> oh, let's see what else we can do while we're here. Can we do anything at all? Hmm, clocks. The two clocks show different times of the day. These clocks are misleading. Neither of them are aligned to the rest of the constitution. Constellation. And this is blocked off there. The tile's been destroyed. Hmm? This is it. The map was right all along. These are indeed the lockers Ginger mentioned. It's odd, but the blueprints must have been switched from the engine. Well, they're here at last. This cupboard contains the blueprints to all of these places. Why is mine last? Yes, let's get them all. Let's get them all. <laughs> Great. Ginger will be thrilled. I need to find that cookie. Find my cookie, huh? Hmm. Fine, let's proceed onwards then. Saturn Devotion Center. Ginger, I was dead worried about you. How'd you get in here? Oh, hello, Virgo. Meet my friend Salvan. He's a good boy. I am a good boy. I and I am also Salvian. I like cookies. I like them too. How are you, Ginger? I'm perfectly fine, but the mission. Don't worry. I found the blueprints along the way. You were right after all. They were around the engine. Although I wasn't directly transferred to Capricorn's room. Only to another star's corridor. So you did find what we were after. We've completed our mission. That's amazing. Salvan and I were looking all over the place around the central engine. Yes, we even found ourselves some more cookies from my collection. We must go now. Thank you for helping my friend, Sal Salivan. I hope someday you can visit the Holy Realms. Please do. I'll be sure to bake you cake cupcakes so you don't have to eat more cookies. But I like the cookies. Come, Ginger. All doors are now unlocked. We should head to the garden where that Kenji got slept. Goodbye, Sally. Farewell, Sullivan. You were a brave warrior. I hope our paths may cross again. Thank you. I just remembered you are the lady who attacked my land friend. You are mean. I might be that. Yeah. Hmm. So where does this way lead? More dormitories. A handful of books about the power of the samurai. Look, Virgo, look, can I take one? Okay, but just one. Be sure to read it fast so I can return it. It's bad habit not returning books once they're borrowed. Okay, I'll read while you exterminate the goat people. Good cookie. Only dare to close pillars and a small frog inside the closet. Okay. Hey, this is the other side of the dormitories. Excellent. This computer has some programs open. One of them shows a conventional door switch. The door opens. Excellent! <laughs> now we have access back to there. Although we only have those. <laughs> no one's going to harm us now. No, get out! What you want me to get out for? I could just simply attack you, you know. Second rule, keep the engine running or our Saturn's wrath will before you. First rule of a Saturn Diversion Center. You must earn your way in with diligent work. This shrine to Saturn is broken. Shining so bright that it hurts the devoted eyes. Shady celery. Have you heard? Seems like Aquarius built a zippelin. And what for? I thought she could fly anyway. Seems like something to do with evading taxes. What an ancap 
would capital this little girl? Quite indeed. Am I mean? Not talking to us? Fine. This fire warms my heart. Excellent. Clather in its own name. Already carrying too many of these. Fine, I shall just drink one, anyways. Good. <laughs> Wait, we can't go through? We can't go through? Each quality represents a personality you will follow when the choice is made. Focus on a single quality decision, whether it's available, may attract the attention of those who say, yeah, and unlock future conversations and story pieces. Some choices require previous staff thresholds to be met before becoming available. But beware. Choices you make will define the outcome of events and the whole universe may be affected. Thanks. Whenever working on a computer feels overwhelming, I come outside to write code on paper within nature. I'm not here. This is an illusion. Who the hell's Bob? T. Reason supplies which include milk, cheese, and more milk. Why do you include milk twice? Makes no sense. If you want any milk, just take it yourself. My job here is merely symbolic. The study of trees is very real at a library. And there's no trees around. I'm studying flying snakes. In this book, in this here, so in this here book, it says flying snakes cause mutable damage. Can we acquire flying snakes? I would like to acquire flying snakes. Fiends, okay. Ship prize. Exorcism. Nice. Tainted. Ouch. Great, now we can't... Oh, great, we can't... Wait, you dodged my attack, didn't you? You... You just keep deflecting my attacks. Can I still attack you? What the heck? We can't do any damage. Yeah, about that. Can I perform an exorcism on you? Thank you. Lemonade. Another book about making the largest cakes. Unlike the first one, this doesn't even contain pictures. What a ripoff. We found Capricorn's diary. Why is it here? Isn't Mr. Dubai's library? Dubai, I have a water go, right? Yes. She's often out running errands to, to Capricorn. Did she steal a diary? Why would Capricorn keep a diary in the first place? Everything is registered in the Constitution, even Capricorn's spores. Why this is here is still a mystery. It doesn't seem like Dubai would steal such a thing. We've seen all kinds of strange alliance scenes in the temple, so it's not entirely odd. Read it. Fighting again. I don't know what to do to keep them calm. They don't seem to match each other very much, and this is hurting our work environment. I tried giving Denaby jobs far from here, but she keeps coming back and fighting with Mishishi again. I hope I'll have a good night of sleep today to keep this out of my mind. That's why she wants to deframe Mishishi so badly, then. It must be sad. You shouldn't feel so sorry for her. Denaby was determined to have what she wanted, just as we are right now. You're right as always, but I can't help to feel as, as if she would be happy if Capricorn just gave her some hugs. Not everything can be sold with hugs, Ginger. This is a lesson you should know. Capricorn's ideals of love never match for common sense. Versatility rose. An old book catches your attention. It explains the probabilities of dying when you stay in bed for over a week non-stop. It seems to have been written by an old guard. And it contains books for small children. Read the grand title. 
Abraham Londes used to always travel by the same path in the forest. Everyone knew how to find them, find him, as he was very strict with his routine, just like you, Virgo. On a numerous day, however, he found what he was looking for the slightest. What is it? What is it? He was perplexed by his discovery so much that he couldn't even breathe. His heart skipped to beat. Oh my! I wonder what it is. This is so mysterious. Swaying just by the sight he found when he came to his senses, he realized that. What did he realize, Virgo? I'm dying to know. To continue reading this marvelous story, please put. Please purchase the full version with season <laughs> Typical. <laughs> okay, so to solve this mystery, I need to buy the full version. Uh, but catch your attention, the great history of Lady Capricorn by James. During the most precious sunset of the galaxy, she lay down in the grassy hills, overlooking her civilization built from scratch by her ambition. The most beautiful of all Zodiac, the timekeeper Capricorn had finally finished her job. <laughs> most beautiful. That's, that would be Persis. First she built an engine, then with a the spare part she made the goatman to operate it. In a moment of peace after such contem contemplation she fell asleep softly under the patient's tree of winter when a small pinkish petal fell into her delicate face. Such petal grew as a lotus over a millennia never to leave a lady's eye, completing her existence with pure beauty. Never again has Lady Capricorn been seen missing her flower. A book about space fencing. Chapter 15, Nibella Combat. To cast Nibella, one must first be surrounded by a cloud of dust containing at least hydrogen and helium, but may also work with other ionized gases. Stardust constructed artifacts bathed in mist, emerald or ruby allow for an easier time channeling dust clouds in a controlled direction. Release nebula requires an initial spark followed by enough pure gases to maintain its beam onto a target. Half of these nebulae may cause skin injury and burns depending on its nature. Amethyst nebula born too quickly and are the coldest while ruby clouds take, tend to take a longer time and therefore reach a hotter total temperature. Emerald clouds will absorb the environment of gases almost immediately providing unexpected results depending on battlefields chosen. The smallest, belt, the smallest book in the shelf is actually a recipe book about the biggest cakes. It, title reads, it doesn't hurt to be the best, right, next to a picture of a five foot tall sweet cake. Delicious. So this is the right way to go, because I couldn't go back through the other door. Maybe I need to go there first, I'm not so sure now. Clock. Clockety clock. Capricorn Gardens. Can't go over there though. Okay. Saved already? You, you've been battling for too long. I can sense danger ahead where my dinosaur sit for sense. Okay, thank you very much. I shall save your recommendation. The time is now. The long awaited moment. I ought to take the symbolism of Capricorn's dominion over these goatmen and faint stars. Without it, she'll have no more power to waste over innocent lives. Both capitalism, cap, capitalism, the workers' manifesto, and all this bribery will come to an end, and tourists will be the next. I shall proceed with caution from now on. It is said that Capricorn keeps with her a large battalion of guards. See, so mean this? Okay. I'm going to buy some items first though, soap mainly. Okay, we face the clerk on the entrance.
the gate of death awaits. <laughs> what is your business here, mistress? I have an appointment with a Capricorn. My password is 63. Oh, you do? That's great. You may pass. While you're at it, could you please tell her we need more coffee in, fr in the front row? We're filled with tea already. Have some. Ah, oh, thank you very much. Well, that was easy. It was very easy. Good for us. <laughs> oh, Capricorn. Who are you? Who enters my chambers unannounced? I am Virgo, daughter of Mercury. Virgo, I see. We have an appointment. What's your password? 63. The guards checked it at the entrance. Registered. You have seven minutes. Let us begin. You and your sister Gemini seems to be in debt with my father. Do you have any problem with the data I have provided you? Data? What data? I have no idea what you're talking about, Capricorn. I am here to dethrone you. Dethrone me? This doesn't sound quite correct. Your father strictly stated you were sent to continue his research. Father is saying unnecessary things again. I have nothing to do with his doings, and I'm not interested in helping Saturn either. Then why are you here for- What is this outlandish creature? I'm not outlandish, I was baked in this galaxy. His name is Gingerbread Man. Don't you dare insult my companion. Don't you dare, I'm a delicious cookie. As for Timekeeper, you, shouldn't have, you should have known by now. I have no more minutes to waste. My weapon aches for infidel blood. Didn't your father tell you to respect your elders, Virgo? I am much older than you. You're not allowed to just barge in to tell me such nonsense. It's far from nonsense. I'm here to end your reign of tyranny. Long before our constitutions became what they are today, our fates were sealed. I must bring back the Golden Age. I must align the constitutions once again. We cannot coexist anymore. Your mere existence is a plague to balance. The only imbalance I feel today is your presence in my temple. You have only five more minutes. Milady, allow me to end this unproductiveness. Do as you please with the Zodiac. The engine must not be stopped. Go, Mishishi, my most beloved lieutenant. Teach her how to respect the elders. Prepare to be removed. Really now? Okay. Oh, I hope you do something good. As soon as the blue moon starts, we we'll need to guard up, anyways. Damn it, you smash from my shield. Um. Damn it, plus our motivation. Um, I can't use a shield anymore, so yeah. Hmm. Just want to think here. Oh, that was a lot of damage. A uh, bag. Wine. Damn it, I've become drunk. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, reckoning. Good, you will not strip me from my honor. Sorry for you. The world is cleaner now that you're gone. Collected. <laughs> Virgo's stats rose. 
equipped blank provides a higher ambition growth. 54 now. It's over, Capricorn. Your favorite lieutenant has been removed. You cannot possibly think of stopping me now. Ready your blade. Ginger, go get the Zeppelin ready. Batelia is still on count cooldown. Milady. Sorry to interrupt your appointment. We're out of coffee from, from the front row. This is not the time, soldier. Ask General or James. Over General, yes, yes. I'm sorry, I've forgotten. I'm sleepy. We've located a supernova event near the engine. It seems that General has fallen. There's stardust everywhere in the engine corridor. Some guards are reportedly unproductive rebels nearby. But we don't think they'd be of any harm for a binary system such as our General. Of course, they would be easily vaporized by her. Is this your doing, Virgo? Only a Zodak could, could have matched her strength. She died to protect the blueprints. If anything, you should be glad of me to have proven her loyalty meant more than her own life. I pity her for throwing such talent away in your name. You do not deserve it. She knew her risks and did what was expected of her job. You merely caused an instability. This is exactly why I pity Denby. Not even her death could take away this dead expression of your face. Don't you feel any guilt having brought such mayhem on the lives of your subordinates? You're a dreadful mother. Have you no heart, no compassion? Guilt, compassion. Those feelings bring no productivity. The engine isn't fueled by emotions. Time flows even if you're not conscious of it, Virgo. You should have known that by now. Your quest is merely a passage of time. It will only bring great misfortune for yourself and all the realms. A fair prize for what to come out that come of out of this unclean world. Sacrifices must be made for the golden age to rebuild this system into perfection. You blame me for imperfection, but your vague purpose has no fun foundations. The golden age doesn't depend on you, and I will bow for no ruler. Defraining me will only cause useless uproar. At least you have no power over your denizens. Let us see for how long you can keep this system going after I take your crown as a zodiac. The security system has proven its failure allowing your outburst, so I'll be the one to keep the engine running. I shall stand idle no longer. Let us do something prof prolific. You have three minutes left. Hmm. Indeed, it is time for us to rise. Stomp. Now you feel ambitious, huh? Okay. Let's lay down some dynamite for the works. Hmm. My ambition will not be brought down so likely. Attack. <laughs> Has a life of its own. Sheesh. Per a uh, reckoning. What the? This is going to be tough. Okay, this is going to be bad. We need to face off the sword first. I think we should have had the other sword on for this one. I'm motivated, nice. That was bad. 
Leave Capricorn to us. We're here to end capitalism once and for all. The Workers' Manifesto has reached its peak. Ah, thanks. According to my agenda, you two don't have an appointment scheduled. Capricorn got her sword back. Saboteurs were removed. What? You hit your own men. Nothing can save your soul now, you wretched fiend. I should have no mercy on you. This fight won't end until you could you drop that crown. Uh, strike twice? That's no good for us. Oh my goodness, we're just going to keep using our items until we die because of this thing. We have no chance against this thing. We're just going to keep using items and then we die. Oh my goodness sakes, this is so bad. Thank you. Right. Exorcism. Well, she can't attack me as ferociously as she did. that double time I call that triple time for goodness sakes again with that is that four times now one two three I have one more ability, but and that does it. <laughs> the world is now cleaner. Obtained crown of Capricorn. I have failed. So have my guards. My company is in ruins. The future is unknown. With those leeches rooming in my doorstep, just waiting for me to fall. I feel sadness. There we go. Virgo, Queen of Purity, but this lotus in my eye dries my tears. All the world is filled with parasites such as this. I hope you have the courage to face fate as I did. Take my title, but I'll keep my honor. You need the courage to face even your friends. If you truly want to bring back the time of the rulers, A few moments later at the Temple Docks. Virgo? Is it you, Virgo? I'm so sorry, I forgot my glasses at home. Or somewhere else. Persis, we saw each other last week. How could you forget my face already? I'm pretty sure it's your hair. Oh, she's beautiful. It looks a tad different. Have you trimmed the ends? Dyed the bands? Lady Passes, it's nice meeting you again. What a delight, you brought in Ginger as well. Oh my, you're such a grown up now, little cookie. Oh, how I missed you. You saw him last week. Have I? I don't really remember it. You must have met another Passes. There's only one Passes in this universe. What about the other universes then? 
Off to the good things now, let's head inside the Zeppelin. Did you know? Did you know? I'm about to throw a huge party. A party for you, Virgo. Oh, my beloved one. And why does I do, do to deserve such festives? I don't need a reason. Parties are fun. I already went and told everyone, but almost no one's coming. They're all too busy or something. Yes, they are. To schedule a meeting with Capricorn, we had to wait for weeks. Woo, I'd be bored out of my mind if it was just a single hour of waiting. As you can see, I've just left the Capricorn's place. It was such a mess down there, lots of despair. And taxes. We just left as well. Virgo vanished with all the taxes. Did you really? That's amazing. I'm glad our little Virgo did something good finally. Those taxes, they're so ugly and unnecessary. Can't we solve everything with a big hug? Virgo said we can't. I guess I'll just leave you two alone. I must rest before the... What? Why? Don't you enjoy our company anymore, my dearest? What about the love you promised me then? Is it because I didn't tell you how much I love you today? Virgo doesn't need endless declarations of love every day, Pierces. I definitely don't need that. And we already discussed this many times by now, Pierces. I'm on my... I'm, I'm on my own righteous mission at this very moment. I don't have the time for these kind of venous matters. You should always have time for my love. Love is the purest ingredient in the universe. The cleanest. Water? Love is what makes the oceans move. Oh, more fluid, right. You can't even talk about it. How can you feel something you can't even explain? There's more to it than useless long words. With love, you can keep the constitutions aligned. Maybe you can even control our fates or change them. Pierces, you are the oracle. Don't forget about it. Can't you see right through our face already? You know that nothing ever changes after prediction. We have to live in this reality as it is. But what is the difference between reality and illusion when I sense both the same way? What separates the truth from lies other than what you feel about them? I know that fate can't be undone. I'm well aware of that. But my feelings towards you, they come from the heart, Virgo. Then, can't we live in an illusion that is our present together? You're wasting time with this hateful quest of yours. Looking for the past, the golden age, in order to change our fates. Does it even matter? You don't even spend time with me anymore. I'm getting old waiting for you to come back. I'll be at your party, okay? I just can't stay with you at all times anymore. I know our lives would be better if you weren't the oracle carrying this burden. But I can't just forget what you saw. That vision you had of me drenched in stardust. The bind blinding light. It all happened today. I have killed a star, Pierces. Even though I avoided confrontations with stars at all costs, she practically threw herself at my spear. I had no options but to eliminate her. Denby is dead. Where she fell, I came across another star that was after Denby. A pink-haired girl whose face was covered by a mask. I... If the whole future you have foresaw and comes true, we won't exist, even exist anymore. I must do everything in my hands to keep the constitutions aligned. Clean everything that is incorrect is my duty. And you know that love won't solve that on its own. Fate is upon us, and we must be a force much stronger than our destinies. We will be Virgo. I trust you. Virgo may be the only one who can trick fate. Trick fate? I trust Virgo as well, even if she's abandoning me. Thank you, Persis. Ginger, you are all too kind. I hope I can protect your kindness from this filthy universe. You will protect us? With a lot of bloodshed? Ginger. Oh, sorry, sorry. With a lot of purification. Will it protect everyone? Persis, be assured. Fate is upon us. Virg fate is upon us. You. You mentioned a masked star. I think I may have something to do with this. I. I might have released something way more murderous than the promises for our future. What do you mean? What have we done? 
I... I might have released the Demon Star Virgo. A game by Nana. Soundtrack. Oh, everything along that. Thank you for playing. Oh, thank you very much as well. Thank you for playing. So is that it? Or is there going to be more to this game? Because there are many more star signs in the Zodiac. So therefore, this would definitely conclude that this is the demo in itself. And that there's something else towards it. So... I loved the experience, I especially loved the pixel art that went into the game. Thank you very much developers of Vertigo vs Zodiac for making this game. Um, if I, I don't know if this is demo before, I don't, it definitely said demo in Etchio, but I'm starting to think, well, there's nothing that says full game, full game or demo, so I don't know what this is. Maybe it's just a first chapter of the game, I don't know. So thank you very much for watching guys, this is Virgo vs the Zodiac. This may be just one part of a of a much bigger journey, which we'll have to wait and see in the future. So thank you very much for watching, we shall see each other on the next time. Have a good day, take care of yourselves.